Hi, hello my Eurovision friends, welcome to a new video. Moldova has decided, we knew we probably would have a comeback here and finally it has been Pasha Parfeni, the chosen one. We know him very well for Eurovision 2012 and his song Lautar with which he finished in 11th place. His real name is Pavel Perfeni, he's 37, he's a singer-songwriter and musician and what I didn't know is that for a year he was the lead singer for Sunstroke Project. Oh yes, finally in this edition uh, Pasha came first, uh, Sunstroke Project were second and Aliona Moon in third place. And yes, in fact I think these three entries were the most interesting ones we had in this uh, national selection. I always love the energy of Sunstroke Project, I think they would have been a great choice too, but it's true that having a, already a saxo guy in this edition, it's not a bad idea to choose something different. So I, I saw the auditions, but I haven't seen the, the final performances, which I expect to have a bigger visual concept. The song is called Suarele Shi Luna, which translates as sun and moon. And I guess or hope he'll sing in Moldovan, so I'm gonna uh, do a quick reading of the lyrics. Here they are, sun and moon, forest with thick leaves, I think I found myself a wife, Niester with smooth water, I lost myself and it's your fault. I sang to her with lots of doinas until she wanted to kiss me. I sang to her, I danced to her, spoiled her in every way. So it seems to have an ethnic component here, some mythological character or some famous Moldovan character, woman. You can explain me everything in the comments. I love to know all the song details. Sun, sun, sun and moon, they will hold us, they will hold us, they will hold us a wedding. Sun, sun, sun and moon, they will hold us, they will hold us, they will hold us a wedding. And this is repeated again. Well, it's certainly a love song. I promised my bride a wedding under a starry sky. I gave to her on the seventh night a ring with a gemstone. <laughs> He's so romantic. <laughs> Sun and moon, they will hold us a wedding. Sun, sun, sun and moon, they will hold us, they will hold us, they will hold us a wedding. And here it's repeating more of these lyrics again and again. Okay, I'm always here for a fairy tale too. So now I want a magic ethnic staging. Please, Pasha, I need some magic and romanticism here. <laughs> Let's dive in. Oh, oh. Drums. There has to be drums. Well, a mysterious start. This is good. <laughs> He's joined by animals. <laughs> oh, in the forest, part in the forest. <laughs> So the chorus is really catchy and this music part with ethnic and electronic is nice. It feels like anthemic this beat. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. I see this stage is a bit limited, but uh, for Eurovision we need more magic here. Or more forest if you wanna go for that way. But anyway, where's the right here? It's really interesting this entry. <laughs> but the, he's not romantic. Where's the bride? I mean, we know he is a great performer. He... Hey! Sun and moon in the background, that has been great. And also the song is uh, energetic. As I was saying, this feels very energetic, very uplifting. I like the, the chorus is catchy and also this uh, musical part with the flute and the electronics. I think it's cool. I definitely think they have to improve a lot in terms of visuals, in terms of staging, maybe creating more a fairy tale, which, are the, which is what the lyrics are about. It seems to have this mythological or ethnic fairy tale story. This is uh, something that makes this song special, so I think they should highlight it more. And the bright thing, this is a romantic song. Where is she? Or is she only spiritual? <laughs> I don't know. I would like to know more about it. But they have time to do it, and I think they have the knowledge, the ability, they can do it. So I'll wait for it, and all the other elements, I think they're great. We know we can trust Pasha 100% as a performer, but he uh, needs all the other elements to support him. I think if they just improve in this visual part, the, the song will change and will upgrade uh, a lot. But overall, I think it's a good choice. We always love ethnicity, and this song is a good vibes song it gives positive energy so this is always great or at least is what i think tell me now what do you think in comments down below thank you so much for being here if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a like and subscribe and see you in the next one take care